I'm not sure if you guys can hear that. It's just a the slightest of slightest metallic grinding. We're gonna take this wheel off and show you what that is. All right, so right here you can see these brakes are brand new, but there's a slight noise, a metallic grinding noise coming from those brakes. Let's see. I, I just want to show everybody that this is actually uh, pretty sweet. This guy did his own brakes and he lubed up everything with anti seize. It's pretty awesome. Even the inside of there, that bolt came out like nothing. You can see here he's using looks like permatex inside the purple magic stuff which is i think it's the best stuff especially here in ohio so but and the the pins look good i'm going to take it all apart make sure they uh make sure they slide i don't think that's the problem i think we already figured out the problem and we're going to show you in a second all right so we got the brake off this is the emergency brake and as you can see it's got a good amount of pad on here, but the inside of this has some dust. So this brake, uh, this parking brake was not adjusted to the new rotor. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to clean this off a little bit. Uh, we're going to get some brake clean going in here. We're going to adjust this brake and get this rotor back on, uh, get it nice and quiet. And uh, yeah, we're going to take care of this. We're looking on the back side of the brake, and this is where you're going to adjust. You see the there's little gears in here, right in here. And that is what we're going to hit with a screwdriver or a pry driver, whatever you guys want to use. And here's a good, better angle of it right there. Let's see if it'll focus. And that is what we're going to try and adjust to bring these pads in. Well, figured since we had all this open, we'd actually show you guys how applying the Ebra works. So it opens up, put pressure. pressure. There's the adjusters down here. And this side is not moving at all. That's pretty cool. So it, it, when this opens up, it self-adjusts inside the rotor uh, and squeezes the entire rotor all the way around. So that's how that works. But well, that's pretty cool. Okay, and that definitely seemed to make it worse. All right. All right, go a little bit. Oh, right, now he's going backwards. Now, it's gone. Good. Yep, good to go. Got to give that brake time to self-adjust. All right, Chris, forward one more time. Oh, never mind. <laughs> it's a... I can't really, I can't tell. I think it's gone. Yep, we're good. Thank you guys and have a good morning.